What's up you guys, Martin here and welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to show you guys I my Halloween Town setup. I love it and I haven't shown you guys in a while. I've had new stuff. So I thought why not show you? Let's look at it. So this is what it looks like in the dark lit up. It's not very dark in here because it is daytime but I wanted to show you guys how awesome this is. So I used to get Bradford Exchange. What that is, it's a company that sends you um, monthly subscription items. Uh, this one's pretty damaged unfortunately but I have had this for so long. It is the Amityville Horror. You can tell it's the Amityville Horror House because of the windows. Very detailed. The pumpkins. The front yard. And I say beat up because it's missing so many branches. And this is just due to poor packaging on my end so I'm kind of pissed off about that. Also, this really nifty one. The details are so cute and pretty. This is from Michaels. It's a little Halloween skeletons coming out from the well. Also from Michaels. Grim Reaper with a horse carrying his victim. I think that's freaking awesome. So cool. Love that. Then we have Lily's Inn. It also lights up. You got the little ghosties. I just love miniatures. It's so cool. Then we have this little cute uh, tomb guy in a tombstone coming out from the grave. Feet first. <laughs> I forgot what this one was. It's based on a true story, a real haunt. Basically, I think it was an orphanage. People swear they see kids in the windows. Um, it's haunted. So I got that. This little witch house. She's like sweeping. Love her. Sweepy, sweepy. Now you're wondering what that sound is because I can hear it. I love this. This is from Michaels from last year's. It is a witch. It does talk. If I lower it because it's too loud, you have witches flying in the air. You have the green smoke from the house. Green lights everywhere and I love this part. There's two witches in a cauldron and witches are like walking around it. I love this little tree house. It has the pumpkins, ghosties coming out of it. Really cute. There's ghosts like flying out, holding stuff. Love that. Then we got a whole bunch of miniatures, skeletons with their cotton candy. I love the Gothic Hills funeral parlor. This one also lights up. The batteries are getting low on some of these, but just wanted to show you guys some of the details. So you have some skeletons chilling. On the side you have a freaking parlor where they're serving stuff. Like sandwiches, spare ribs. And there's the little guy making martinis. Love that. It also lights up. And the cool thing is it's closed. And then I love their windows. It's a window and inside is like a coffin. So it's like a 3D effect. Like you want to see, oh look, there's a guy in there. I think that's so cool. I love these kind of things. Also, we got some like grave diggers walking. Wendy gave me this one. She got from a yard sale. It's like just like a little scenery. I love this one too. We got some more people signage. Yeah, a couple walking. I love this. You can have this on your wall. It's almost out of batteries. That's why I turn it off. I could put more in, but let me see here. 
it does light up the moon lights up lights up from there the windows light up there's another 3d effect inside there then you have another 3d effect inside there there's a witch it's just really really cool so yeah short video but I wanted to show you guys kind of like my collection I want to get so many more but they are expensive if you guys want to see more of my collection let me know in the comments below if you guys like this video please like subscribe favorite share with your friends and family for more content and until next time you guys don't be a lemon be a rosebud peace